What's up everybody, it's all real here and welcome to another Yu-Gi-Oh! 101 fan day for July, Ju uh, July, wow, September 12th, 2014. Why do I have a habit of saying it's July every anytime I get ready to do one of these videos? I don't know why, like, July isn't even my birth month. Nothing special happens to me in July. Why do I have July on the brain? Anyway, a um, couple things I gotta clear up because... I kind of messed myself up for things that I wanted to do for Fan Day uh, tonight, and I didn't fully think things through, so I do apologize if anybody else got confused. I'll do, trust me, I'll make it, I have plans to, you know, try to correct myself to this, to where things like this won't happen again, but just shooting straight for the point, um, today's Yu-Gi-Oh! 101 Fan Day was supposed to be on Skype. It was supposed to be a Skype fan day. However, when I did my ADS play uploading schedule, like you guys know that I usually announce what what type of fan day I'm going to be having, whether it just be a regular fan day or whether it be like a Skype fan day or whatever the case. And in the ADS play uploading schedule, I had announced that it was going to be a a regular fan day that wasn't going to be on Skype. But then later on this week, I think yesterday, I had did a video for a new concept to Fan Day that I had wanted to start um, on the 15th. And it was called Viewer's Choice Fan Day. Now what that is is that you, the viewers, decide what archetypes or what you know, series of cards or what mixture of archetypes you would like to see me use and I'm gonna do it with, and I would take my take my talents to do the network and I would do my best to make a a playable build with the archetypes or mixture of archetypes or series of cards that you had suggested. The reason why I was doing this or the reason why I'm starting this is because you guys see me make playable builds. Like playable builds that are actually very consistent. Um, you know, saying like with my retro modernization series, where I take archetypes and cards that people have deemed to be so unplayable, and you know, I decided to challenge myself to build a deck with those, and I've completed it. You know, and it was fun, and I didn't have anything else to do with retro modernization because I felt like I touched on all of the more difficult series of cards and archetypes that you know people have been complaining about since the early days of Yu-Gi-Oh so after I completed that it was like well I still like to challenge myself or whatever so why not get the you know like the viewers involved hence the name viewers choice fan day where you guys decide what I should play now mind you all you're doing is uh, just suggesting what cards I will be using not the amount that I can have in my deck I'm not ready for that yet <laughs> I don't think I'm that good but just making suggestions as to what type of cards what archetype you know or what series of cards you feel like I should make a build out of and then I give you like a shout out in the video um, you know say okay like this suggestion was made by you know like this guy or this girl you know what I mean like I would uh announce who gave me the suggestion you know and um I don't know like I think it would be like a pretty fan interactive experience and that really the whole goal is to get me stumped it's your challenge as the viewer to see how impossible you can make me or how difficult you can make it for me in order for me to build a playable deck that's the challenge here so again, give me like a mixture of archetypes um, or a archetype that you think I just can't make a build out of or anything that you feel like I could do something good with, you know, and it's going to take me a while to make those builds. And hence, hence the reason why I had set the viewer's, viewer's Choice Fan Day for Friday and next week. Now, another thing I have to announce. <clears throat> um in that video where I was announcing the viewer shorts fan day for the 15th uh, next week I, I believe that's the 15th next week 
no, 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 uh, the 19th, I'm sorry, 19th, but, um, on the 19th, which is Friday next week, um, I wanted to give people enough time to make suggestions and respond to the video so that I can have time to go and build those decks that they wanted to see me, uh, use. And, um, the problem with this is that I don't have, like, the most responsive fan base, and I do mean that with the utmost respect. Like, I don't have a fan base that responds as, as like, quick as I want them to, but I don't think anybody does, but I'm not talking about them, I'm just talking about me right now. Like, I feel like people just... It takes time for people to catch up to the video because they got other things going on in their life, obviously. And, you know, it pretty much takes them a while to realize that this is the video. You know, well, like the video is up or whatever. And, um, really, when it comes down to it, like, it just takes them a minute to respond. So... So pretty much I'm just uh, trying to give people time to respond to the video so that I can get a reasonable amount of suggestions because I want this to be fun and I want this to be very lengthy so I want people to um, you know to have fun trying to come trying to conjure up any ideas that they have and you know, we could, uh, you know, have fun for Viewer's Choice Fan Day. Now, again, this Fan Day was supposed to be on Skype, but because it was, I did, like, the update video as to me doing it on Skype, people didn't, really didn't, you know, like, people didn't get the memo as, as quickly as I wanted to, and when I logged on my Skype, it was like people weren't even ready for a Skype Fan Day, so that's my fault, and I'll, again, do better to leave those announcements and, and stick with those announcements in in the future for any type of fan day that I announce so next week it won't be a Skype fan day however the following week it will be and the following Friday it will be a it will be on the on the last Friday of the month on the 26th and so I do apologize for everybody that was expecting a, a Skype fan day and didn't get it. Again, I kind of shot myself in the foot with that one. And, of course, it'll never happen again. And um, I'm going to do my best to, you know, make sure that you guys are more aware as to what's going on. So thank you for that. And uh, anybody who I do on the fan day today, you know, thank you, and uh, let's have some fun. Oh, and one more thing I forgot to announce. Uh, this Monday, um, I have a job interview at 12 o'clock Monday, and I need to, you know, like, prepare myself for that. So in the event that I do get hired, of course, I'm going to let you guys know. But I, I'm also going to work my schedule around so that I can make sure I do Viewer's Choice Fan Day that week. So I'm really hoping I land this job because I got a lot of plans for this channel that I really need to, you know, get going. As far as like systems and hardwares I need to buy, and, as well as various other things. Because you guys know that I do video game playthroughs on this channel as well. So, and it's plus it's been diff a variety of things that people have been wanting me to get back to that I just haven't been able to do. Um... Um, because of some financial restraints, but hopefully that can change by the end of this week. You know, hopefully by next week we'll be able to get, you know, all those plans started and we can move on. So, uh, with that being said, peace and thank you for watching. And let's get started with Yu-Gi-Oh! 101 Fan Day 9-12-2014.